the interview. Uh, Linda, what do you think? Yay, finally. Yeah, it took a little bit, but I got it going for you there. I'm not sure if it's a long-distance connection. So, Linda, from Albuquerque, New Mexico, we've got you on the line. Uh, tell us about yourself and what made you start singing. And we're going to translate this into Spanish at the same time. So let's get busy with having fun with this and uh, telling us what uh, you like about singing and uh, doing all these great songs. And you've got, you sent me four of them. Go ahead. First and foremost, I want to say thank you for inviting me. It's an honor to be um, on this interview. Um, my name is Linda Rebecca Archuleta. Soy de Cerro, Nuevo México. Um, I'm actually just living here in Albuquerque. I grew up in the small little town there in northern New Mexico. My mom, my dad, everybody always sent me out to you know, Albuquerque and um, Hurricane Junior, Flora de las Flores, you know, during cleaning time and whatnot. And um, I just became really attracted, um, you know, to the music. You know, my mom would even listen to like the spookies and you know, numerous groups. And um, I just all of a sudden, you know, told my mom, like, I want to start learning music. So around five years old, she, um, one of my aunts, um, I recently passed away, she got me this small little guitar. And of course, you know, I never knew how to play it that much then. But I would just pretend, you know, play it and sing songs. And I don't know, the passion just grew from there. So I would sing in front of my family. They'd give me a dollar here, a dollar there. And I just, you know, was always so passionate about music. And then um, as I reached, you know, like my what, middle school year, seventh grade, I actually joined mariachi. So from um, like, you know, my younger years till now even, I've um, played mariachi for like 12 years. So finally, um, I don't know if y'all are familiar with that, Steve Chavez. Um, I reached out to him and I asked Steve Chavez if, um, you know, I could record my first CD. But of course I was transitioning from the mariachi style the New Mexico style. And um, so in, what was it, 2009, ooh, excuse me, I uh, met with Steve Chavez and we recorded my first CD entitled uh, Sugar Baby, which is a song um, dedicated to Al Hurricane. So he just talked about and so and you know, it makes my heart happy. He <laughs> kid said to Sugar Baby. So, um, I don't know, just music has always been a, a big part of my life like that. Um, my family, you know, would get together and jam sessions and sing, and I just always was very fond about music, and it's still a big part of my heart. I also attended um, Adams State University now, and I got my minor in music there, and then afterwards I kind of skedaddled away from Colorado and, you know, northern New Mexico, and I actually came to live in Albuquerque where I graduated from UNM as a elementary teacher. <laughs> well, that sounds so really good, Linda. Um, hi, Linda. This is this full speed. <laughs> <laughs> no, I think that was perfect. This is Sylvia Tassiri. Um I'm here also on the station. And uh, so, how long you been singing? So basically, I've been singing right now. I guess you know, like women should never really build age up or age. I'm 28 years old. <laughs> so I've been singing for the past 23 years. Oh, that is really good. Por favor, this is the. In 2009, I'm sorry. Go ahead. Por favor, habla en español, por favor. Bueno, un poquito. Me pone un poquito nervioso cuando lleva tiempo de hablar en español. Pero a ver, y hace como 23 años cantando música. Empecé desde muy muy chiquita con mariachi y con música nuevo mexicana y también nuevo mexicana. Um, tejano, you know, me escucho mucho a Emilio Navarra cuando era joven, um, era uno de mis ídolos, bien grande. Um, of course, todas las muchachas me gustan a Selena. <laughs> sí, <laughs> muy cierto. <laughs> yes. Y um, yo creo que nada más que la música es, es algo que siempre llevo en mi corazón desde, desde muy, muy chiquita. En 2009, um, el release my primer, mi primer disco, uh, que se llama Linda Rebecca Sugar Baby, y luego otra vez en 2014, el segundo um, entitled Linda Rebecca Dos Corazones. Dos Corazones was an original song, kind of like a Tejano style, about, you know, love and love and all that fun stuff. 
And now, um, it just means, what are we, 2017, almost 2016. I am actually, um, re just released two of my first singles on this new CD. And, um, Tristes Recuerdos, and the other one is called De Mañana en Otro Día, which is a duet that I did with uh, Dwayne Ortega. Yeah, we're going to so actually listen to those songs. That's the best way to do it. <laughs> yeah, she's a great singer. But yeah, we're going to listen to some of your songs uh, here in a little bit. And there we go. Uh, uh, Linda, it's been great talking to you. you. You really gave us a lot in a short time, and we really like that. And I Sylvia just made you talk up a storm. I get you guys, ladies between ladies, <laughs> I guess you guys get to talk, and I can't even talk. You, let me talk, man. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding no. you. Well, you know how it is. I'm just a teacher. He has to fit everything into such a small schedule. Yes. Sometimes that, you know, you got to be used to it. Right. <laughs> so since uh, you're an elementary uh, school teacher, you've seen the elementary Henry, right? <laughs> <laughs> the yeah. hijo de carnicero that's what he is <laughs> <laughs> he's just a little kid too so. he's just a little kid in a grown man's body <laughs> and Linda I think I think you should just be proud of you know our age you know it's like um, uh, I think you know that's um, how we are made you know just going through all these years and our experiences and everything so everybody asks me like yeah. do you mind how if I ask you how old you are I'm like Oh, I, I can tell you how old I am. It's, it's okay, you know. Because <laughs> when I start talking right. about the yeah. 80s and stuff like that, and they're like, oh, that's classic music. I'm like, is it already? <laughs> well, I can tell you my age. I'm 30 yeah. years old with 32 <laughs> years experience. <laughs> yeah. And I, thought, and I thought you just had your 21st birthday, Henry. I did. I acted like I was <laughs> having the 21st birthday. <laughs> if you were there, you would say, you're acting like you're 21. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> it's all fun. Linda, we're going to play your music. One, we're going to do uh, Three on the Tree. Uh, you've heard of that before in New Mexico. If you had an old vehicle or old car, you had uh, the, your gear shift on the, on the uh, steering column. It's called okay. Three on the Tree. So we're going to do all three of your songs, uh, the two singles and uh, Dos Corazones, uh, uh, all three, three on the tree. So if you're listening, let's get started. And uh, you can introduce the first one, which is uh, uh, Boy uh, Rosario. Mm -hmm. You ready for it? Which one? Voy a rezar un rosario. Oh, okay, sorry. Next song, coming on right now, voy a rezar un rosario. L Linda, thank you for uh, patching in to KUHS, and uh, have a good day, okay? Thank you. I hope to see you guys soon. I'll be dropping in Denver in the next month or so. You bet. Come and see us. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. All right. Thank you. Bye-bye. Work. We're still alive. We got to work in. We got the interview done. So she seems um, like a very nice lady. <laughs> she seems like a very nice lady. Sylvia Taziri. 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 Sylvia Taziri. Yeah. It's po pobrecito can't even talk. You know? <laughs> We're having a great time here in the studio at Canciones de Domingo. Uh, what you're hearing right now is Linda Rebecca. And one of her, I think this is the first one that she's got two c singles that she just released. And uh, coming out of Albuquerque, New Mexico, Linda Archuleta. Hey, Archuleta, okay? I thought she was uh, related to you. She is. Oh, she is? <laughs> yes, she is. <laughs> it, not really, sort of. Okay, it's, on, it's a relation through a marriage. Oh, okay. So her cousin is Archuleta, is married to my son Archuleta, so they didn't change their name. It's Archuleta. Oh. So isn't that crazy? Yeah. So, uh, so she's out of, out of Albuquerque, New Mexico, so for in case you want to know about that. Linda Archuleta, buy her CD, download it off CD Baby, and take a look at her, all her stuff. It's great, great stuff. Baby Sugar? Or Sugar Baby? Sugar, sugar Baby. Sugar Baby. Sugar called. Baby. Yeah, I thought it was CD Baby. My bad. <laughs> no, it was Sugar Baby. <laughs> her! <laughs> But yeah, she said she's, she might be coming to Denver. So. Yes, that's right. It's going to be great. I, we want to have her here in the studio and uh, probably see her live uh, here. And uh, Coming up here at 1230, we're going to have Luis Pinon live in the studio. That's going to be a little bit different. So we'll reposition the camera so you can see what he looks like. And It's been real. So for now, uh, we'll see you all later. Talk to you at 1230. So uh, watch for the live feed, okay? See you in a bit.